Tiro Belanger is the Jedi Master of Aggie Cathar, Cathari. Uh, Cathari was found by Master Belanger on Alderaan uh, when she was three and brought to the Jedi Temple. Uh, Belanger and Cathari fought together in the Clone Wars alongside Officer Timu Diodai and Commando Kita Masho Suldo. Did you read your background info? Yes. Okay. I ain't stupid. Did you read your race, the species info? Yes. Okay. So you understand where this sort of... Yes, I'm going with some variety this time, not just some white chick. <laughs> yeah, Maybe that's Delta that's Zach. Race. Zach's playing the white chick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is there Starbucks in space? I mean... <laughs> uh, near the end of the Clone Wars, uh, Belanger and Cathari hired a smuggler named Garrick Mer Marancy. Marancy. I... I I did a random. I don't know how to pronounce my own names. I did. Yeah, yeah. I did a random character. I, I did a random name generator. So you mean you had butted the keyboard? Yes. No, there's actual Star Wars name Aggie. generators. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and a bounty hunter named Yurius Kilvari, uh, as informants as well as allies for missions that required more secrecy. Uh, you guys were at the Battle of Coruscant on that last day, and were at the temple when it fell. Uh, the six of you guys managed to escape Coruscant and are now with your ship, the Wayfinder. Who has the Wayfinder? Oh, yeah. uh, and let's see, with the plan to go to the planet of Aratera, where Master Belanger believes a strong convergence in the Force will allow you guys to hide from the newly formed Empire and maybe even start a secret Jedi Academy for any survivors. Uh, Garrick, you're flying the ship. Uh, when you see an Earth-like planet, because that's apparently what Aratera looks like. <coughs> I put your shit there. All terror. Cool. All terror. Oh. Did you mean Earth? No. Yeah, well, I what mean, is Earth? What is Earth? There's a little bit more. What is Earth? For 500. Yeah, there's a little bit more desert. Mm -hmm. And it only and it's uh 280 days per year. The days are shorter, only 18 hours. Um. Mm -hmm. uh, so the re the re actually uh go ahead and what's your uh, knowledge lore. Three green. Okay. Give me any. <laughs> Go ahead and roll that. And if any of you guys want to know why he's going there, why he suggested it, actually, you already know. Uh, so they, explain. I'll explain what, explain once other people decide to. Did you? Well, the reason you're going there is because you've heard of a Jedi temple that was there. Oh, okay. And you're hoping maybe. The Empire hasn't gotten a chance to get rid of it yet. Are they going to roll? Do you guys want to Or they roll? could just ask you. I don't know. Okay. Do you guys want to ask them what's going on? Because you don't know why you're flying the ship there. So where do you want me to land? <laughs> Preferably on the surface in a hidden cavern. So that way our ship is undetected. And can I ask you why we're going to this planet? I believe there's a Jedi temple that has yet... To have been breached by the Empire. Right. My Before plans are to go in and make it our base of operations. Hey. It's worth a shot. So I'm going to start taking the ship down and looking for a, a nice cavern to land in. <laughs> well, funny enough, uh, there's some caverns right near where the temple is. So. Oh, even better. Even better. Even better. So <laughs> it's, it's within walking distance. Awesome. So I'm going to land in one of them. <laughs> yep. Okay, well, you make it to the caverns. Uh, you have to go through the caverns to get to the temple. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. this is what it looks like. Gotcha. gotcha. So which cavern do you guys wish to go through to get to the temple? The one on the right. That's my bet. The okay. ones that are... Actually, foresee for us. Okay. <laughs> How do I do that? Well, no. oh, but he can only use it once a day. Can he only do that? No, I thought it, you said it was only once no, a day. No, he can see up to a day. Also, we haven't... Uh, yeah, rolled our... Oh, yeah, we haven't. Well, I'm going to roll for the two NPCs. Okay. In case somebody shows up to play them. One dark. One light. So, so far, balance in the force. I thought you were Two Too dark. dark. Too dark. <laughs> Darkness is taking over. 
One dark. One dark. Six dark. One light. Two light. Six dark. Three light. So you have just enough to spend on being able to foresee. It. Okay. So do you want to do it? Sure. Okay. Do you want to spend any other points? Because you you got you're pretty powerful in foresee. It's in your notes mm. and the extra notes because I made it to where like you you basically bought the entire talent tree for yeah. for C. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's right here for C. For C everything really. Are you just gonna do a basic for C? Yeah. Okay. In that case, uh, hmm. That that is what I am. Are you looking? Which way are you, yeah? Which way are you looking? The center of the three, oh, the center of all the entrances. Okay, so in between the first and first one on the left, because there's four entrances. Yeah, so, so four on looking in the middle. Okay. Uh, <coughs> you sense a darkness potentially on the right. Okay, so JP, yes. I don't think right's a good way to go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what do you actually see? What do I? Because you can see the events. Well, can see, can't he? Vaguely, because yeah. he didn't. He didn't spend any extra points to see specifics. I just okay. want to see basics. Because you can, he can use more of his point of the light side points to see more specifics, but it's better if he. Okay. I was about to shake this up there rather than one with you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, also, you have a power that has a. Uh, that gives you an automatic, um, what's it called, uh, a conflict, don't you? Yeah, I can add conflict. Well, no, you automatically gain a conflict at the beginning of a session from it. Yep, just from knowing that ability, you gain a conflict. Which way are you guys going to go, then? The first or second? I say second on the left. I'll trust my pad one. I'll go with them. I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you have a 50 morality, so yeah. Smoking them midichlorians. <laughs> Actually, I can give you specifics before you go that way. I can give you a little bit of a specific. You actually see... Uh, some Jedi being killed. Oh. You sense you, you sense that some Jedi mm -hmm. are gonna die on the Two right. Days ago now. <laughs> yeah. A day from now. God damn it. A day from now. <laughs> Fuck. Within a day from now, anyways. Somewhere within a day. Oh no. <laughs> Only two Jedi right now. <laughs> <laughs> that you know yeah. of. Maybe there's yeah. some Jedi. Uh. Huh. Urias so like, Urias walks up and she's like, well, maybe there's some other Jedi. Whenever already I, here. Whenever I foresee, we were talking about this in the car. Is this the type of timeline where I can change it, or is it permanent? Like, no matter what I do, two Jedi. You can are change it right there. Okay. Jedi are all about the living force, so you can change it. Basically, be uh, Quicksilver and X Men and change it. <laughs> just don't, just don't pull a. Uh, don't don't pull a uh, Jedi Council where you're trying so hard to change it that you end up forcing it to happen. So. You guys actually make it to a giant funnel where, and it, the the path widens oh. as you go through it. Before we do that, I actually wanted to do something. Oh. I'm going to send my RMD20 to the right side to view. Okay. Which one? Left or, which which one the for one the right side? The one danger from. Okay, well which... One on the right, there's two entrances. The far right. The far right. Okay. Alright, so we're going to follow your droid for a bit. Mm -hmm. Okay, so your droid's going to go down the path, and then there's going to be another split off. <coughs> Left. God. Okay. Uh, Alright, and it keeps going, and it hits a dead end. Alright, it's going to go back and go the other way. Dead end. Okay, it's going to come out of that one and go through the... The other right side that I didn't get to. Okay, it's gonna follow you guys into the funnel. Wait, what? 
Into the what? The funnel that you guys were getting towards. Because yeah. it's funneling out open. But I'm making it go through the other Yeah. Path. Okay. It, I'm looking it at the map. It yeah. comes yes. back. Oh, it comes back. Okay. So they all led to the same place, but for some reason, within a day, Jedi are going to die in those two right times. Gotcha. Well. So, let's just, if we can, both avoid those tunnels. <laughs> well. At least a day. Three. No, forever. The future could be the reason why the future happened. Yeah, I've, I've considered that. But. Yeah, remember the Jedi Council basically did that. <laughs> They're like, oh, we know that that happens. Hey, you. Yeah, you watching the video. It's me, Toki Supreme. I'm here to let you know that if you enjoyed this video, you need to like and subscribe. Also, if you want more Star Wars adventures from us, you should check out Escape Reality Films' Patreon page, which you can find in the link below. If you don't do at least one of those, I will send my army of Wookiees after you. I am the machine! Cuckoo, cachoo!